second, guys, real quick. Before I, uh, before we get started with the video, I want to clear up some things. Now, first off, this has to do with friends of, uh, one of my friends, Shane's girl. I was called in to help her out. Even though I have been dealing with an abscess the past few days and a one or two fever, I'm actually shivering and sweating right now as I record this. And it was like that when I was playing. I mainly got it on because I wanted to help her out because I owed her one. She's been a good friend of mine, and the fact that I was attacked by Nasty wasn't her fault. And for those of you that have been watching my channel for a while and might have seen the video in the past, around the time I met Shane's girl and Nasty. Now, Shane's girl I met after the battle, but that's just nasty and some of his friends attacked uh my friend uh Wimbley and them and we got involved in a big policy war back when we still ran with a guy named uh chopper's revenge and chopper got some of his buddies and there was a huge war because they called in a lot of their friends and there's basically a group of four posses fighting two posses against two we ran with some posse that had like the wolf tag or whatever uh, that I think had choppers back. Then we had um, me fighting alongside Wimbley and Beast and Beauty in them, as well as Nasty and his friends. Well, the whole battle uh, turned into a clusterfuck really fast. But Nasty was one of the people getting laid out, and of course he got mad because I uploaded the video. So. Needless to say, he is not that happy having been found again, but I got in to the session. I go right up to them because they're the first red dots I see that are nearby, and I'm checking, and I realize, okay, this is her people. I'm gonna, I'm gonna just walk up and see if they're in game chat. Sure enough, a couple of them were, but I had to get my mic. But I was just real quick riding up next to him, looking for Shane's girl. They were single that I was there. Immediately, Nasty identifies me, and though it's not heard, he says, Oh, it's that cyber wolf bitch, and he starts shooting at me. I get trampled by my horse, and I immediately retaliate. And, of course, him knowing what happened last time he and I fought, which you can check the video on my channel, he knows that I'm going to lay him out, so he left two people level in, in the levels of 60 and 90 in, in those ranges to fight me two on one but of course the loda i run as well as the way i play when i'm fighting people like this now nasty's a known tryhard from the videos i've had in the past so i came prepared for it and i was ready to fight him of course the loadout i use now the way i fight is Taylor made for fighting tryhards and griefers because the thing is, last time I fought him, he used explosive rounds. You can't lock on to somebody use explosive rounds if they're in defensive. Best part is, I can't be taken out defensive if I hit you with my rifle after you've hit me. If you already hit me, you show us bright red. So, enjoy the show. Nasty, I hope you see this one too and you just know. Even though I didn't kill you, you didn't kill me either. You can hold them else because you ran like a little bitch. Deadshot, farm boy, next time, Shane's girl, next time your posse leader calls somebody in, don't shoot at them. Or better yet, if they don't shoot at you and they're just riding by you not doing nothing, they mean you no harm. Don't start shooting them because you never know what they're going to do. Anyway, let's get on with the video. I hope you guys enjoy.
So explain to me why you guys are attacking me. Hmm? I'm waiting on an answer. Very well, this will be just another video for my channel. Whatever. Mm -hmm. 